Hey guys, what is up? It's Anna. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, then hello. You should definitely hit that subscribe button down below. In today's video, we are going to be doing a Gymshark haul slash kind of review. I have been going to the gym a lot recently over the past couple of months. And before I place these Gymshark orders, I have never had Gymshark activewear. It has always been something that I wanted to try. And it is a little bit on the pricier side, so I'm going to be telling you guys what to get, what not to get, what are my favorites just so that you guys don't have to go and waste your money or go through the return process because I know that is such a struggle and I hate doing that personally. Hopefully, fingers crossed, I will save you guys a little bit of time and money. And I will say some of these things I did get off the Gymshark website and some of them I did get off Poshmark. I will be letting you guys know what I got off Gymshark and what I got off Poshmark and what I paid for it, my sizing, everything like that. And let's just go ahead and jump right into this video. Okay guys, so I'm going to be starting off with the things that I couldn't find in a set or that I just didn't get in a set. I guess I'll start off with the top. This top is the Vital Seamless Long Sleeve Crop in Black Marl and I got this in a small. I really do like this top. It's just a simple long sleeve black crop top and then it does have the little Gymshark logo right here and yeah I really have no complaints about this it is a really nice tight material it is very airy but I do really like this top and I do recommend this top I got it in black and I also got it in a pink color which I will be trying on later for you guys and now we are going to move on to the leggings these leggings I got off Poshmark and they do kind of bunch at the bottom but I am very short so I find that with a lot of leggings that I do get so it's not a problem for me I just kind of roll them at the bottom so it's a little bit less noticeable that they're bunched and I could not find them on the Gymshark website so I think they're discontinued I don't think any of the other leggings that I got are discontinued because all of the other ones are on the Gymshark website so I'm really sorry about these but but there is a chance that you can find these on Poshmark because I have seen a couple of these on there let me just pull it up on my phone and tell you guys how much I paid and everything for them so these are called the Gymshark compression leggings and I got these in a size small and they were listed as $28 so with shipping and everything it was $34.49 and I really do like these. They do really suck everything in because they are compression leggings. I like how they're two-toned. There is just a little tiny bit of camel with these if you like really kind of put your legs together. But I mean, I don't typically stand like that. I don't know about you guys. I usually stand with my legs kind of apart. These are the back of the leggings. They do have the little Gymshark logo at the top. These leggings, I'm going to give them a 9 out of 10. And this top, I'm going to give a 10 out of 10. Also, I really like how, if you guys didn't notice, I do have hip dips. But um, I am kind of working on making those less noticeable slash like getting rid of them. I like how these don't really accentuate my hip dips. So if you guys have hip dips as well, then I would definitely recommend the leggings that are high-waisted really suck in your waist because it makes them a little bit less noticeable. All right, the next pair of leggings that I'm going to be trying on is this pair of ombre leggings. These are still available on the Gymshark website, but I believe at this moment they are sold out. So on Poshmark, these were listed as $30. I got these in a size small and with shipping and everything they were $36.49 so not too bad I'll tell you how much they are originally on the Gymshark website let me just pull it up okay so on the Gymshark website these are the ombre seamless leggings and they retail for $50 this is the peach coral color so I would say I got a pretty good deal on these these are the seamless peach coral style leggings I love these they're so comfortable I personally really like high-waisted leggings just so that I can wear like cute crop tops like this with them again these do kind of bunch at the bottom but I just roll them I am 5'1 just for a reference if you're any taller than me then these would probably fit you perfectly lengthwise they do have the little Gymshark logo down the side right here one thing I will say is the little crease or the little like arc for the butt is a little bit on the low side like my cheek starts about here and it's kind of down here like the little arc is like down here that is a little bit low but these leggings are so so comfortable and I personally love working out in these because I feel like they're just so movable and these I don't think are see-through really we can do the squat test on them but 
I don't think they're see-through. I know we didn't do the squat test with the ones before this, but I will say those are not see-through at all. So the next style of leggings that we're going to be trying on are the flex leggings. I know these are super, super popular with Gymshark. I think these are the dark Ruby Morrow pair, and then I have the khaki pair as well. I got these both off of Poshmark. I misspoke. These I got in the Beat Morrow color. So on the Gymshark website, these retail for $38. And like I said, I got these off Poshmark, so I'm going to check and see how much I got them for. If these were listed as $25, I got them with shipping for $31.49. And then the khaki ones were listed for $30, so with shipping, I got them for $36.49. These are the Beat Marl Flex Leggings, and I will say, I don't know why, but the Flex Leggings are so super super long. I actually had to roll these at the bottom because they were so bunched that it just didn't look right. So if you are on the taller side then these would be a good pair for you. Another little thing that I don't like about the flex leggings is they aren't high-waisted. Really really wish that these were high-waisted but if I pulled them up anymore it just would not look right. As you can see it kind of sits right above my belly button. They probably usually sit like right here but I like to kind of pull them up a little bit more just because I like to have my belly button covered and then the thing that everybody loves with the flex leggings is the little butt kind of contrast because it really makes it kind of pop and like lifts it up I guess so for me personally I'm going to give the flex leggings a 7.5 out of 10 just because they are extremely long on me they aren't high-waisted they are super super comfortable though and I do really like how they have the little band underneath the butt those are some positives and negatives to these leggings and I will try on the khaki ones, ones as well just so that you guys can see what those look like. So here is the khaki pair of the Gymshark leggings. I feel like I like this pair just a little bit better than the other pair just because I'm a sucker for these like army green type colors. And we will do the little squat test with these so you guys can see that I do not think these are see-through either. And same with the Beat Marl pair, I don't think that they're see-through at all. Alright, the next pair that I'm going to be trying on is from the Gymshark Fit Collection, and these are just to the plain black leggings. I did get these ones for Christmas, and I got them in an extra small. I will be exchanging these for a size small, just because they are a little bit tight around my thighs, and I'm going to be trying that on with the pink crop top. These are the Gymshark Fit Leggings with the long sleeve vital seamless crop in pink. Like I said before, I love this crop top. This one is a little bit on the see-through side, as you guys can see. You can kind of see my sports bra underneath. I feel like it's supposed to be like that because it's that light, airy material, so I'm not going to knock any points for that. I still give it a 10 out of 10. Love it. I love the color. The little Gymshark logo is right there. I don't know if you guys can really see it because of the lighting. So that's that for the top. It is still a 10 out of 10, just like the black one. I don't know why. It might just be me imagining things. I feel like the pink one is just a little bit softer than the black one and as for the fit leggings I do really like these as well but they are just a plain black pair of leggings with the Gymshark band across the top the material on these is a more spandexy style material so they remind me a lot of a Nike athletic legging which I personally really love so I'm gonna give these a 9.5 actually no I'm gonna give these a 10 because I really I don't think there's anything that I don't like about these. And I believe these are the cheapest pair of leggings on the Gymshark website. They are $36. Yep, these are $36 on the Gymshark website. I think these are squat proof as well. And that is it for all of the non-sets that I have. So now we are going to move on to the sets that I bought. I'm going to be starting off with the set that I like the least. And this is from the Dreamy Collection. It comes with this little crop top and then the matching leggings. You have little pockets on the side, but I'm just going to try these on for you guys and you'll definitely be able to see why I don't like this set. So here is the Dreamy set and I'm going to start off with the top just because the top I actually like. It is just a simple crop top, has the little Gymshark logo on it there. It does come with padding in it. It is a cropped style. I just don't know about this like little band. I don't know if that's supposed to be there or it 
looks a little bit awkward. I don't know if it's really meant to be there or if the material in my specific one is just kind of bunching. So I'm going to give this an 8.5 and I am going to keep it because I do really like the color of it, but I like the fit but that's the only thing that's a little bit odd about it. And the leggings, the leggings are the things that I don't like and I will be returning. I feel like they're a little bit big on me, as you guys can tell. The crotch area has a lot of bunchy material and I feel like the butt just isn't flattering at all because I feel like it's a little bit big. Maybe if I went with a size extra small, it would have fit me a lot better and it would have looked a lot better. So if you do want to try it out, then I would recommend maybe sizing down in the dreamy style leggings. So I am going to give these like a six because they don't fit. They're not really true to size, so I would recommend sizing down, but they are a nice material. I'm pretty sure they are squat proof as well. This one is another seamless set. This is the Vital Seamless Sports Bra in Dusty Pink Marl. And then the bottoms also in Dusty Pink Marl, obviously, because they're a set. All of these sets, I believe, also come with long sleeves. I prefer the sports bras. I do think they have two other colors in this style. And this is the seamless set on. I really like this one as well. The sports bra, I'll do a little close up of that. Again, it does have padding. All of these sports bras come with padding. It has the little Gymshark logo. And as for the leggings, they are high-waisted, which I love. They do also have that tight band around the waist, which doesn't really accentuate the hip dips. It has the, the little Gymshark logo here. And here is the back. One thing I will say, I feel like this set was made for short people, which I love, because the length the length, if you guys can't tell, is like absolutely perfect. It hits right at my ankles. So I feel like if you're any taller than me, then these will be a little bit short on you. But for all of my short people out there, you should definitely get this set. And as for the little camel toe situation, I feel like with any pair of seamless leggings, you're just not going to be able to escape that. And we're going to be doing the little see-through test with these ones. I am going to give this set a 10 out of 10. Love the sports bra, love how it has padding. I love the length on these. Of course, if you're taller, you probably won't love the length, but since I am short, the length's perfect and I love it. Love how they're high-waisted, so this set is a big thumbs up from me. If I do forget, I will have them listed on the screen. The bottoms were $50 and the top was $35. And for the next set, I got an ombre pink set. The bottoms of these I got off of Poshmark and the top I got off the Gymshark website. This set is still available on Gymshark. I got both of these in a size small. For the sports bra that I got off of the Gymshark website, I paid $38 for. And then, like I said, I got the leggings off of Poshmark and I paid $45. So with shipping, I paid $51.49 for these. This is the Ombre Seamless set. This is what the sports bra looks like. It does have built-in padding, but I feel like the quality of the padding in this one is not as good as the quality of the padding in the last one that I showed. And that's just me being extremely picky and honest. It does have the Razorback detailing and the little Gymshark logo here on the side. And as for the leggings, it does have the little Gymshark logo here on the side and that is what the back looks like. I love, love, love the ombre effect. I think it is so pretty. The quality of this set is great as well. The one thing that I don't like is that these leggings come with built-in underwear. You can kind of see the built-in underwear. So I really don't like that. I'm actually contemplating cutting them out because it's just, it's not cute. I'll show you guys if I squat. You can see the underwear, but you can't see my actual underwear. So that's just something that I really don't like. Let me know if you guys think it's a good idea to cut the underwear out, I'm not really sure. Just let me know if you guys had these leggings, what you guys decided to do. For this set, I'm going to give it an 8.5 because I feel like the quality of the padding inside the sports bra isn't as good, and I just am not a fan of the built-in underwear. Moving on to the very last set. This one is my personal favorite. I saved the best for last. It is the brand new camo set. I got it with the little v-neck sports bra. You can also get it with the long sleeve. Like I said, 
most of these sets come with long sleeves and then it comes with the seamless leggings. This set, since it was a new release, is a little bit more on the expensive side. The leggings were $60 and the sports bra was $45. So that is a little bit steep, I think, personally. But maybe once the like newness wears off, they'll kind of drop the price. All right, guys, just take this in. Tell me this is not the cutest set ever. I absolutely love it. I know I've said that already like 10 times. But this is what the sports bra looks like. I think it is so flattering. I just think this whole set is so flattering. I really love the cut of it. I love the back, how it has like a ton of crisscross detailing. It comes in purple and it comes in like a blackish gray color as well. These again are that super soft, seamless material. They have the high-waisted band. So absolutely great for people with hip dips like me. It has the little Gymshark. I think it's on this side, yeah. It has the little Gymshark logo kind of carved in right here. Not carved in, but you know. And then the butt has the little scrunch detailing, which is super flattering and makes your butt look really good. It really makes it pop. So yeah, I really have no bad things to say about this. So this is easily a 10 out of 10. And if you're gonna get anything, from this haul it would be this set all right guys that is it for this whole gymshark haul slash review i hope i helped you out i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did give it a big thumbs up and hit that subscribe button down below if you're not already subscribed to my channel i would really appreciate it and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys